Hi and welcome to this Blender tutorial about Neon Text. It's going to be super easy and there's not much modeling involved to create 3D text like the ones you see here. Let's get started. So first of all delete everything and add a text. Let's, let's change this text to Hollywood. That looks cool. And then move to the center. Now rotate 90 degrees on the X and that's where the magic happens let's add a font I'm gonna make a link available in the description so that you can download those exact font that I'm using once you have this done you want to convert into a mesh and once it's converted you select everything and extrude and then you have a very cool text but it's not complete now from the front view we want to add a cube that's going to be the surface where our uh, neon text is hanging. All right, and then we move a little bit to the back. Now let's go in render view and let's see what's going on. So first of all, we want to go in cycles so that we can have some nice reflections. Give to this material a black color, make everything dark, and then selecting the text, apply an emission material. Boom. Now, this is just part of the job. We want to make sure that there is some reflection on the black cube in the back. So we pump it up a little bit, uh, the, the emission strength, uh, so that we can have the reflection. And definitely, you know, changing the color makes everything cool. As you can see, it's very simple because it's a font. And you can go crazy because you can convert into a mesh and extrude the model as much as you want. Let's try another one. Let's add a new text. And let's write this time Soho. Soho is cool and short and serves the purpose. Okay, now Soho, let's pick another font. All right, this is cute and there is a lot we can do with this. Uh, I'm just showing you a little bit. So if you convert this into a mesh, you have a mess, but it's very easy, as you know, to select the thing that you want. So first of all, let's select everything and let's give this guy a material um i'm going fast so i'm not you know changing the name of the materials but i strongly suggest you guys to give name to everything even to the objects into the collection now we want to give the material to uh those uh inner circles here so let's start from this one i select one vertex and i do l and then to this one i apply a new material and assign to it and then let's go in render view so that we can see what's going on on this side and this one is going to be our emission so if we you know step out we can see that this is already an emission you can go on and do as many material as you want to this text and then assign this but this one is an emission and we're going to make another color probably um, let's do this purple here and let's pump it up to five and then we start having some cool things i'm going to speed up this so that we can you know go directly till the end of uh, the procedure and so we have our cool soho neon text now as you can imagine you can extrude this and go crazy with the with the shape um let's try what happens if i take the entire text and then extrude you know to the why that's a lot going on in terms of uh, geometry if we put this cube here it's like you know some sort of billboard hanging we have some reflection here uh, that we can see we can pump it up a little bit you know also the white to five and you know you can go on let's make the last one so top view text okay so this one really looks perfect to be transformed into a mesh so let's rotate 90 on the X and then convert into a mesh select everything and extrude now we have this cool looking thing guys only from a font I know that's not a great news but you know let's be creative and create things uh, that are easy to do so let's make another one text edit and let's write this time New York City and then for this one I'm gonna use a different font let's apply um, a new emission material to this one probably 
let's say green let's rotate 90 on the x and let's apply this to our new black cube let's give this a little bit of strength and here is glowing let's do it's vegas let's see what happens with this one okay as usual convert and extrude you know up to you you can be creative with colors with the way you shape the the text after you convert into a mesh you can do many crazy things honestly really just be creative and do whatever looks good to you well i hope this gives you a good idea i'm gonna make a couple more and then we're gonna say bye okay so we made quite a bunch of neon uh text here you can use different colors different shapes you can go crazy with modeling after you convert the text into a mesh and honestly really the limit is just creativity so let's go crazy and see what you can do with those fonts uh, i say it again the link is down in the description it's going to lead you to the page where i downloaded those fonts for free and uh, i believe that you can do whatever you want with those fonts read what's written on the website about the usage of those fonts but they are super cool in blender and i hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you in the next one bye